Ah. Oh, yeah, interesting. Hello, hello. Uh, but you are not happy. Come on. <laughs> you should be happy. Hey, the teacher is here. Come on. That is... My teacher is good night. How are you doing, people? I'm fine. Excellent. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for your response. And what about the ladies? How are you doing today, ladies? Hi, teacher. Hi, good night. Good night. Hi, hello. hello, hello, hello. Nice. Hi, teacher. Hello. Hi. Nice to see you, right? Nice to see you, everyone. How was your day? A good day today? So, so, bad day? How was good your day? day? So, so, good day? Perfect day. Good day. Good day. Excellent. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I feel happy. And I am happy that you have a really nice day. Perfect. 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 Thank you so much for your punctuality to be here to the class. Thank you. Thank you. We're going to get on some really interesting information for today. Let me look at my document so we can get started. Here's my document. Excellent. I have the information ready. At this moment, as you know, we begin by checking on the attendance. And so when you listen to your name, please make a verbal confirmation that you are part of the video conference. Please. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much. Let me check on the info at this moment. All right, let's see. Alejandra Gabriela Perez. Alejandra Gabriela Perez, probably not at this moment. I continue. Ana Guadalupe Fuentes. Present. Thank you, thank you. Azucena Enriquez de López. Azucena Enriquez de López. I continue. Brian Joalmo Rodas. Present. <laughs> Carolina Abigail. Present. Thank you. Cindy Tatiana Vasquez. Cindy Tatiana Vasquez. Present. Thank you. Cira Verfali Aguilar. Present. Thank you so much. Claudia Elizabeth Martinez. Claudia Elizabeth Martinez. Erika Vanessa Marroquín. Present. Thank you, thank you. Esmeralda Janet Méndez. Esmeralda Janet Méndez. Present teacher. Thank you so much. I need your collaboration. Present. Please. Thank you, thank you. Present. Thank you, thank you. I need the collaboration with the microphone, please, 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 please. Thank you, thank you. Turn it off when I call you, please, right? So the people can listen properly. Hello, hello. Pedir su colaboración, por favor, con el micrófono, por fa, por fa. Lo activamos cuando yo mencione su nombre, así tal vez eh, los compañeros pueden escuchar cuando se les llame, ¿verdad? Pues recordamos que el sonido ambiente, nosotros no lo percibimos, pero nuestros compañeros sí lo perciben. Entonces, nada más pedirle su colaboración. Porfas, porfas. Thank you so much. Uh, I continue. Ah, Esmeralda already confirmed. Thank you. Ya confirmó Esmeralda. Muchas gracias, Esmeralda. I continue. Evelyn Abigail Ramos. Present. Thank you, thank you. Fátima del Carmen Amaya. Present. Thank you, thank you. Giselle Maria Hernández. Present. Thank you, thank you. Indira Nirvana Hernández. Present. Thank you so much. Ana Ivania Guevara.
Ana Ivania, probably not at this moment. I continue. Jose Hernan Maravilla, I guess not available at this moment. Uh, Josué Abraham López. Josué Abraham. I can continue. Carla Guadalupe Pacheco. Carla Guadalupe Pacheco. Carla Lizeth Méndez. Present, teacher. Thank you, thank you. Uh, Luis Daniel Rosa. I am here, teacher. Thank you, thank you so much. Madeline Beatriz Morán. Miss Madeline. Right, I continue, no problem. Let's see. Uh, Mari thank you, thank you. Thank you so much for the confirmation. Uh, Maria Jose Sandoval, I guess she's not available at this moment. Mariana Dolores Moreno. Present teacher. Thank you, thank you. Uh, Marlon Napoleon Fuentes. Present. Thank you, thank you. Rina Estela García. Present. Thank you. Rolando Guzmán Revelo. Present teacher. Thank you, thank you. Ruth Stephanie Melendez. Present. Thank you, thank you so much. Sandra Marisol Campos. Present. Thank you. Tito Alberto Hernández. Present teacher. Thank you so much for the confirmation. And Xiomara Alejandra Marvin. Present teacher. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, everyone, for your confirmation. Let me see at this moment. To get on some info. Yes, yes, yes. Falto. Uh, uh, all right. Thank you. Thank you. I guess. Let me see. Anne Ivania, right? Yes, yes. All right. Present. Perfect, perfect. I double Thank check you. on this one. No, my pleasure. Let me see. Ana Ivania Guevara de Gonzalez. Perfect. Thank you so much for the confirmation. Now, people, I have just one announcement to make for today's class. And my announcement is to remind you about the work in the platform. At this moment, we are working in, uni in week number three, right? Week number three for the calendar of the classes. And in the platform, you need to complete this week section or homework number four. So at this moment, I am going to read on the people who are already working in unit number four. If I don't mention your name, then that means that we need to do some catch up work, right? Voy a mencionar en este momento las personas que ya por lo menos están trabajando en la unidad cuatro. Eso es como el mínimo, ¿verdad? Recordando que estamos en semana tres y en esta semana ya deberíamos estar trabajando y idealmente tener, si es posible, completa la tarea cuatro, ¿verdad? Tarea cuatro. Así que voy a leer las personas que ya llegaron a eso. Usted puede que haya terminado la plataforma, pero yo voy a tomar de referencia la tarea 4, ¿verdad? Usted sabe si ya terminó, no hay problema. Happy for you, no problem. Si no le menciono, el llamado es para usted para que nos pongamos al día con la información. Ya nos falta poco tiempo para terminar y aparte es uno de los requisitos para inscripción del siguiente módulo. Así que de verdad animarles a que podamos terminar, si es posible, terminar este fin de semana la plataforma, chivo, démosle, perfect, perfect. So, let's do an effort. Let me check on this one. Voy a leer las personas que ya por lo menos comenzaron a trabajar tarea cuatro. And this is Ana Guadalupe, I see Ana Ivania, Azucena, Brian Joalmo, Carolina, Cindy Tatiana, Cira Berfalia, Claudia Elizabeth, Erika Vanessa, Esmeralda, Esmeralda Janet, Evelyn Abigail, then I go for Indira Ivania, Indira Nirvana, sorry, Indira Nirvana. Then I have Josue Abraham, Carla Pacheco, Carla Mendez, 
Let me go to the other page. Let's see. I have Luis Domin Rosa. I have Madeline. Then I have Mariana, Rina, Rolando, Ruth Stephanie, Sandra Marisol, Tito Alberto, and Xiomara Alejandra Marroquín. Right? Congratulations to you all. Las personas que mencioné ya han iniciado a trabajar en su tarea 4. Algunos hasta ya terminaron la plataforma y eso es muy bueno. Pero los que ya comenzamos a trabajar, vamos bien. Así que les animo a dar el último, el último pasito y completar la unidad, si es posible, en esta semana, en este fin de verdad, viernes, sábado, domingo y así lunes, que ya se realiza la, la actualización. De hecho, yo realizo la actualización del, de su cuadro de notas. Ya tenemos todo 100, 100, 100, 100. Ya estamos listos para la inscripción del siguiente curso, ¿verdad? Porque es uno de los requisitos. Si no le mencioné, le animo a seguir trabajando y hacer dar siempre lo mejor de usted. All right. Uh, let me see. Let me get on my presentation at this moment so we can begin with useful practice for today. Let's see. All right, this is the one. Now, at this moment, we are going to have session number 11, you know, session 11 for this course. And we are working in the beginner level, module one, session 11. Take a look at this one. We're going to begin by checking some vocabulary. And after that one, we're going to check on the grammar content that is very important to talk about. At this moment, I am going to show you a picture or some pictures of a clothing item. Do you see the picture? The next one, I show you almost the complete name of the item, but as you will see, the item does not have the vowels, right? Check on this one. For example, This is the clothing item. This is the name of the clothing item. But as you can see, there are some squares and they are covering the vowels. The vowel A, E, I, O, and U. No consonants, only vowels, right? That is what we have covered. Tenemos por ahí el artículo del cual vamos a mencionar su nombre. Yo ya les di ahí la palabra, pero si usted ve, hay unos cuadritos que nos tapan ciertas letras. Esas letras todas van a ser vocales. De todos los ejercicios que veamos, todas van a ser vocales, no consonantes. ¿Ok? And to work on this one, I need your collaboration on spelling. Spelling the item. Right? Vamos a deletrearlo. Si lo conoce, perfecto, pero no necesito que me diga la palabra en este instante. Vamos a trabajar juntos y vamos a deletrear la palabra. Por ejemplo, T, y si usted se sabe la siguiente letra, me la menciona, ¿verdad? All right, let's do it, let's do it together, hagámoslo juntos. One, two, and three. T, E, 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 Okay. Stop, 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 K, 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 thank you. <laughs> perfect, perfect, right? That's fine, thank you. Como We mentioned, T, ¿sí? vamos palabra por palabra, perfecto, vamos bien. T, sí. hey, what is the name? Right? O, 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 or A? O, A. All right, thank you so much. Double checking on this one. The first word was a K. T A A K K and the next one T O P Excellent. And in this one, you mentioned tank top. Tank top. That is the vocabulary word. Exactly. Tank top. This is a special, a special uh, clothing item, especially when everything is hot. Right? It's hot. Right. It's not good to have a sweater or a, or a shirt. It's fresh to have a tank top. And you see, 
for boys mm -hmm. and for ladies, right? You can call yes. them like that, right? Thank you, thank you, thank you. Ya ve que tenemos el mismo artículo tanto para chicos y para chicas. Lo mencionamos tank top, que sería como un centro, ¿verdad? De los que nosotros vemos por ahí. Tank top, it's fresh, really fresh. Especially if you live, uh, if you live in a hot place. Especialmente si vivimos en un lugar un tanto caliente del país. It's eh, la unión con Chagua. La unión con Chagua, excelente. Conchagua is a nice place. I visited Conchagua one time. It's really good. It's a beautiful place. Yes, it's beautiful. I visited uh, Espíritu de la Montaña. It was a really good experience. Uh, I, I am tourist guy. Excellent. So when I need, when I need some information about tours, I contact Tito. Thank you so much. Yes. Perfect. Yes. Perfect. Perfect. Thank you. Let's see. Let's check on the next one. Good job on that one. Good job on tank top. Take a look at this one, people. This is a clothing item you wear on your head. Right? Yes. That is what we have. How yes. do you call it? Take a look at this one. This is the word, and remember, the vowels are missing. Right? Only the vowels are missing. How do you spell this item? How do you spell it? B. B the next one? B N. Mm. Ah, the next. Ah, mm. no, the, the, the missing squares, right? Ahí en los cuadritos celestes nos hacen falta las vocales. Nos hacen falta cuatro vocales. How do you spell that one, people? Oh. 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 Uh, oh. Mm, oh. Not oh. Give give it give it other try. A. U. A. A. And this one we go B. E. E. The next one. Mm. Give it a try. Recuerden que solo son vocales. I. I. Mm, not really. A. Hey, thank e. you. Perfect. B. E A N. The next one. I. I. And the last one. O. O. Uh -uh. It's not O. E. 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 Thank you so much. Perfect. E. Perfect. This is like working the hangman, right? Aquí como que estamos Bien. jugando el ahorcado. ¿va? Y si lo jugaba usted en el diario, la adivinando ahí las letras. All right. Thank you. But that's fine. Good job. <laughs> In this case, this clothing mm. item, you call it beanie. Beanie. Huh? Huh? That is a beanie. Especially, beanie. right, for hot weather, exactly, a beanie, right? Yeah. It's uh, like a cap that is really, uh, really close to the shape of your head. Right? Lo que nosotros conocemos como un gorro es como los gorritos de lana, ¿verdad? Ya sea para el frío. Y que quedan bastante ajustados en su cabeza. ¿verdad? Ese, es el, ese es el Billy. Right? That is how you call it. Did you know on this one? ¿Lo conocían en inglés? No. 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 Perfect. We're learning vocabulary. No. Perfect. You see? Learning yes. every day. Excellent. Thank you. Take a look at the next one. This is a special one. Take a look at this one. Right? That is a special <laughs> one. And, and also take a look at the uh, take a look at the introduction, the right? Chancla. One more time. Chancla. <laughs> and you call Chancla, Chancla. Hey, Chancla. Careful, careful, Chancla. Teacher, careful teacher. <laughs> Perfect. Thank you so much. This is the vocabulary word on this one. Now flip. let's work oh, together flip. the spelling, right? We work with the spelling e first. Let's do it together. <laughs> Everybody I together. Excellent, excellent people. You call it flip flops. Flip flops. Good memories with the flip flops, right? Good memories. Right? Excellent. La, arma letal. Yes, right? That is the, the, the help, the tool, right? A tool for mothers. Right? Ah. Una herramienta para las madres, right? <laughs> para Let's hacernos clap. personas de bien. Personas de bien, no yes. problem, right? Thank you, thank you so much. Perfect. And if you have the chance, 
to wear these flip-flops, you remember that when you are walking and it is raining, yes, right, you have like a cover, right? Hasta yes. le servían de rodilleras, ¿verdad? Si usted las utilizó algún día y estaba lloviendo, pues no me va a dejar sí. mentir que de repente le quedaban uno como que eran rodilleras hasta acá cuando uno se yeah. deslizaba, ¿verdad? All right, perfect, perfect. Thank you so much. Good memories, everybody. Good memories. A ver, thank you. All right. Tal vez ahora ya los chicos solo son crocs, ¿verdad? Crocs y no sé qué. Now, but now for our generation, flip flops. Flip flops all the time. All right. Thank you so much. Let's check on the next one. Take a look at this one. This is a yes. clothing item for ladies. Take a look at the word. And I need your collaboration to discover the spelling for this one. Let's do it together. A H H I A Urban. 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 Exactly. Urban. 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 Thank you. Thank you so much. That's correct. That's how you call this clothing item. Urban. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Now, let's work on something at this moment. But let me check on this info. All right, we're going to check on some information to continue working on clothing items. And also we check on, at this moment, confirmation questions. That is what we talk about. Take a look at that person, right? We have a representation of one person. And at this moment, take a look at this one. Remember from yesterday, we were talking about the present continuous. That is the information we were talking about in yesterday's session. Do you remember what is the use of the present continuous in this context? ¿Te recuerdan en qué contexto estamos utilizando el presente continuo? Do you remember? Yeah. What do we use it for? Do you remember? How do we use it? ¿Cómo lo estamos utilizando ayer? Una acción continuo? se está realizando en el momento. It could be possible. That is one use. Thank you so much. That is one. She is wearing. Use. She is wearing or he is wearing. Thank you so much. Perfect. The two answers are she perfect. The two answers are perfect. The present continuous could be to describe what is happening in the moment. Right? For example, I am talking. You are listening. Right, we are having class, something in progress, it's possible. But at this moment, we're using the present continuous, as we mentioned, to describe what the person is wearing. Right, las dos opciones que me mencionaron son aceptables. El presente continuo nos sirve para hablar de algo que está ocurriendo en este momento, en algo que está en progreso. Así como les decía, verdad, yo estoy hablando, usted está escuchando. Estamos recibiendo clases, eso es algo que está en progreso. Y eso ya lo vamos a ver más adelante cuando veamos más a fondo el presente continuo. But in this one, we use it to describe what the person is wearing. Así como la práctica del día de ayer, lo utilizamos para mencionar qué es lo que la persona está vistiendo en ese momento. ¿Ok? Eso es una descripción. Take a look at this one. Take a look at that person. I can create an affirmation, right? This is something, a description about him, about the clothing item, right? He is wearing gray shoes. That is an affirmation, right? It's not a question, not a question. In this moment, take a look at this one. And I need your collaboration because I know this topic. You are an expert probably on this topic. How do we create a yes no question in the present continuous? Convert that one. How do we create a question with this information? He's not wearing. Ah, he's not wearing? That is a negative. Yes, he is. 
Ah, he, okay. is, he is. He wearing he, a gray shoe. wearing a shoe. All right. Thank you so much. I listened to the answer in the, in the participation. Take a look at this one. What happens in the question? And this is what happens. The first one is an affirmative sentence, not a question. That is just the reference we have. Take a look at this one. The first element is. The second element is he. Is he, 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 he wearing 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 Exactly, you are correct. That is how we create just no questions in the present continuous. As you can see, the only difference is the position. He is wearing affirmative, affirmative sentence. Is he wearing question? And something important, remember on the question mark at the end, the one you have in green, question mark is very important when you create your questions in the written form, right? Is he wearing? And now, what about on the answer? Is he wearing gray shoes? What is the answer for that one? Yeah. Yeah. Yes. 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 All right. Thank you, thank you. A yes. short answer could be, yes, he is. Yes, he is. Simple like that. What is the negative sentence? What is the negative answer for this question? No. No. He is not. No. 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 Perfect. No, he is not. Or you can say, no, he is not. Or no, he isn't. No problem. Remember the contractions? No problem. Right? Those are short answers. Short answers. On this case, right? Now, let me ask you a question. Let me ask you a question. Is he wearing a cap? Is he wearing a cap? No. No, he isn't. 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 All right. No, he isn't. Thank you. Perfect. Question. Is he wearing a scarf? No, he isn't. No, he isn't. No, he isn't. No, he isn't. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much. As you can see, that is how we can create questions. At this moment, we are going to practice as a class, and I am going to give you the opportunity to create questions. You can create questions based on what he's wearing, or you can create questions based on other clothing items to obtain a negative answer. Podríamos preguntar, en este caso, utilizando la estructura, justo lo que la persona está vistiendo, y en ese caso obtendríamos una respuesta afirmativa. Pudiéramos crear o eh, poner un complemento, ¿verdad?, de, de los artículos que la persona eh, está vistiendo en ese momento, algo diferente. Por ejemplo, mi pregunta, ¿Is he wearing a cap? The answer is a negative answer, because he is not wearing a cap. ¿verdad? Podríamos formularlas de cualquier forma con un complemento en cualquiera, puede que obtengamos una respuesta afirmativa or a negative answer. It's possible to express ideas like those. Now it's your turn. And let me start on the practice. Miss Brian Joalmo, can you create a question, please, for your classmates? Uh, based on this picture, una, pre una pregunta basada en esta imagen y los demás compañeros tratamos de responder. Thank you so much, Brian. Check on the microphone, please, please. please. Okay, okay. Thank you. Is... Uy. Tengo problemas ahí con la imagen. No problem. Make it a zoom. Is Make he... it zoom. Okay. Uh, is he wearing uh, sunglasses? Uh -huh. Is no. he wearing sunglasses? No. Answer? No, he's not. No, he's not. No, he's not. No, he's not. All right, he thank can. you. Thank you. Two, possi top, two possible answers. Nice job. Let me choose another person. Miss Evelyn Abigail Ramos, create other question, please. Okay. 
Is he wearing uh, earrings? Is he wearing earrings, people? Earrings? Right? Earrings. No, no, he's not. Yes. Oh, he's not. Yes, really. No, he's not. No, he's ah, not. Earring. Yeah. Earring, yes. Okay. Earrings. Ah, hearing. Hearing, yes. Earrings. Earrings. Yeah. Probably wow. not. All right. Wow. Thank you so much. <laughs> Probably because the picture is small, right? But I assume no. <laughs> Tal vez la, la imagen es pequeña, very pero small. yo asumo que no. Very small picture, right? Very small picture. Probably the answer is negative. Thank you. Let me ask on other person. Let me give the opportunity to other person to create a question. Uh, let me see. Miss Carla Lisset Mendez, can you create other question, please? Is he wearing a sweater? Is he wearing a sweater? People? Yes, yes, he is. Yes, he is. Yes, he is. Yes, he is. Thank you. Yes, thank you. Perfect. Good answers. Now let's continue asking on some people. Mr. Daniel, I don't know if you are available to participate at this moment. I need your collaboration to create other question, please. Mr. Daniel, hello, hello. All right. Is he wearing jeans? Is he wearing jeans? Yes, he is. Thank you. Yes, he is. Yes, he is. Question. I create a question. Yes, he is. Thank you. Is he wearing red jeans? No, he is. Yes, he isn't. No, he isn't. No, he isn't. Thank you. No, you he see? Isn't. It is possible to incorporate colors. If you remember yesterday, we were checking with colors. You can incorporate a color to create a question as well. In that case, you can obtain a negative or a positive answer. Let me give the opportunity to other person. Miss Sandra Marisol, create other question, please. Is he wearing audifon? Let me see. Let me check on this one. In that case, could be headphones. Headphones. Oh. Headphones. Mm -hmm. headphones. Is he wearing headphones? Yes, he is. 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 Thank you, thank you. And let me check another person to continue on the practice. Miss, let's see. Miss Rina Estela, if you have the chance to participate. Thank you so much. Okay. Is he wearing travel backpack? A travel backpack? Uh -huh. Thank you. Yes. A travel backpack? Yes. Yes, he is. 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 Perfect, perfect. Just double check on this one. Let me give you some general feedback. Thank you so much on your participation. Let me work on this. Remember when we create questions, remember it is possible to talk about something in plural and it is possible to talk about something in singular. Take a look at this one. Is he, let me see, let me write some information. Is he wearing a jean? Let me copy some examples, right? And we're going to discuss. Déjenme por aquí armar unos ejemplos y de ahí veremos, eh, los vamos a analizar. Is he wearing, let's see, shoes. Is he wearing, uh, let's see, headphones, as you mentioned, headphones. Is he wearing, Sure. A sweater. All right. Thank you. I will include that one. Is he wearing a short? Take a look at this one. 
In this case, shorts is usually in plural. Now, let's take a look at these examples, please. That is like a general feedback to continue improving, right? Veamos los ejemplos por ahí. Nos van a servir de retroalimentación para encontrar si existieran áreas de mejora. Take a look at this one. Take a look at number one. La primera que escribí por acá. Number one. Is he wearing a jeans? What do you is think? Is that the correct jeans? form? Yes, he is. Yeah. No. Yes. No. no. Is he wearing jeans? Ah, thank you so much. I listened to the answer. Thank you. Is he wearing jeans? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. In this one, people, you don't mention a jeans, right? Sorry. Okay. You don't mention a jeans. Take a look at that one. Why? Because I remember gives the reference of number, number one, about quantity. And jeans is considered plural. Plural and singular don't match, right? Ya no hacen juego, ellos no encajan. ¿Por qué? Mencionamos un artículo en plural, por ejemplo, los jeans se, consider se consideran plural, ¿verdad? Y si decimos a, entonces como que nosotros dijéramos un pantalones. pantalones. No hace juego, right? So in this case, for plural elements, a, not necessary. The question is, is he wearing jeans? Correct, correct question. Take a look at the second one, number two. Is he wearing a shoes? Correct. All right. In this one, sorry. Right. This one is correct. Is he wearing shoes? Correct. En esta no tenemos right. a y hacemos referencia a algo plural. Shoes. A is not necessary. Question is correct. Thank is you. Is he wearing headphones? Is correct. Take a look at this one. Number three. Is he wearing headphones? Is that okay? Correct. Correct. It's correct. correct. Headphones is plural. Headphones is plural. Right? Los audífonos en este caso se consideran plural. Entonces no necesitamos a, ¿verdad? Así que tal cual está la pregunta, estamos bien. Is he wearing okay. headphones? Perfect. No a. A headphones? Not possible. Take a look at number four. Oh, sorry. Number four. Is he wearing a sweater? What do you think? Correct. Okay? Correct. Correct. It's correct. Thank you so much. Fine. A sweater. Talking about the same quantity. Sweater, only one. A one. One, right? They match. Right? Eso sí hacen pareja. ¿verdad? Sí, el, la información es correcta, ¿verdad? En cuestiones de cantidad. A sweater. ¿verdad? Un suéter. Perfect. Take a look at the number uh, number five. Is he? Oh, sorry, the spelling. Me hace falta una e por ahí. Is he wearing a shorts? Not is correct. It's not correct. correct. Not, correct. Not, correct. Not, correct. not correct. What is the correct form? Is he wearing, is he wearing shorts? Wearing shorts. Wearing, shorts. Wearing, shorts. wearing shorts. Exactly. Is he wearing shorts? Thank you so much. Is he wearing shorts? And then you respond, yes, he is. Now he is, right? But double check on that one. Pay attention to that important element. Before we go to the next practice, is there any question about the information we are talking about? Questions, questions? No question. No question. Thank you so much. Thank you. No question. Perfect. I appreciate on your confirmation. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Let me get on this one. Uh, let me hide this information. All right. This is what we do at this moment and just to have more speaking practice. At this moment, we are working in small groups, probably four people working together and we are going to do something similar to the previous exercise. One person in the group asks a yes, no question with the present continuous. Similar to the exercise, is he wearing is she wearing the same format, all right? The question should be to confirm if the person is wearing something in specific, all right? Is he wearing, is she wearing? Vamos a formular preguntas, yes, no, right? Yes, no questions, para confirmar si alguien está vistiendo cierto artículo, así como lo hicimos en el, en el ejercicio de la imagen, similar, similar. 
And in this one, the rest of the classmates look at the classmate and respond properly, right? The reference is the other classmate in the group. Let me do an example for this exercise. Let me choose a person that is in the class at this moment. All right, I am going to take a Rolando for an example. Lo voy a utilizar a usted, Mr. Rolando, para el ejemplo y lo voy a poner en el spotlight. Lo voy a hacer famoso. Creo que todos van a ver su cámara en este momento, correcto? Sí, correcto. Excellent. Thank yes. you. He's famous at this moment, Rolando. Thank you. Cambio de oficina. Excellent. Oh, no, Rolando. Wow, my goodness. <laughs> Excellent. Thank I you. <laughs> Come on, Rolando, you can do it. Excellent. This is what we do. This is uh, just a demonstration about what you do, right? Esto es lo que vamos a hacer ya cuando estemos en los grupos. Usted va a escoger a alguien del grupo. En este caso, yo voy a hablar acerca de Rolando para que hagamos el ejemplo. I am going to ask to the rest of the class, ¿verdad? La pregunta no va a ser directa para Rolando, sino la pregunta va a ser acerca de Rolando. Vamos a utilizar is he, ¿verdad? Porque la pregunta, nuestros compañeros nos la van a responder. Take a look at this one. Is Rolando wearing um, a white shirt? What is the answer? No, he isn't. No, he isn't. No, no he, he isn't. No, no he, he isn't. isn't. All right, thank you. Perfect. No, he isn't. No, he isn't. Thank he isn't. you. Is Rolando wearing glasses? No, he no, isn't. No, he isn't. He isn't. No, no, he isn't. isn't. No, he isn't. Is Rolando wearing uh is wearing uh headphones? Is he wearing headphones? Yes, he is. 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 is Rolando wearing a scarf? No, he isn't. No, he isn't. No, he isn't. No, he isn't. All right. Is Rolando wearing flip flops? We don't know. Oh. <laughs> we, don't know. <laughs> we don't know. No problem. No problem. No, 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 no. no. Right? Remember maybe. Not maybe, maybe. All right. Maybe. maybe. We don't know. All right. This is what we do. In the small groups, you do something similar. One person asks a question about other classmates. You look at your classmate and you respond. Yes, he is. No, he isn't. Or if you are talking about a lady, yes, she is. No, she isn't. All right. That is what we do at this moment. The question is about one classmate, not direct. Right. El ejercicio va a ser preguntarle a sus compañeros. Verdad, es una pregunta acerca de alguien del grupo. No vamos a hacer preguntas personales como are you. ¿verdad? No serían así directas. Así como yo lo hice con Rolando, si ¿sí vieron. Estaba hablando de Rolando, pero él no me respondía nada porque yo lo estaba utilizando él, the top model, right? Yes. Excellent, right? Thank you so much. That is what we do in the breakup room. Is there any question about the activity, people? Questions, questions? No question. No, no question, teacher. All right, perfect. I like it. Everything All white. Cool. All white, right? All... <laughs> Excellent, thank you. <laughs> nice. All right, we're going to create uh, on this one and remember to alternate, right? One person creates a question, the rest of you answer. Lo vamos a hacer de una forma que una persona pregunta acerca de alguien y todos en el grupo respondemos así como lo hacemos en clase acá. Yes, he is, no, he is. Right? Cuando alguien pregunta, va a, va a rotar. Otra persona escoge a otro del grupo y hace una pregunta con el objetivo de que todos vayamos preguntando y todos vayamos respondiendo en todo el tiempo que vamos a estar en la práctica. No va a ser solo uno haciendo preguntas ¿verdad? para todo el grupo. Not like that. You ask some questions. All right? Let's get started at this moment. Thank you so much. And I will be checking you, right, Tito? Por ahí llego, ¿verdad? Tito, y le llego okay, ahí al okay, grupo, all right? Yes. To everybody. Thank you so much. Let's work at this moment. Thank you.
también aparece, aparece pantalla. Bueno, comenzamos. Ok. Sí, ya pregunta. Um, veamos. Eh, si usan, comienzo con pregunta. Ah, is, he, is he wearing. Eh, déjenme ver. Eh, sería Marlon. Is he wearing a hat? No sé si se puedo decir la, su nombre. Sí, sí, sí. Ajá. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Hello. Hello. Perfect. Perfect. Okay. Uh, okay, Marlon, is he wearing a hat? No, he's, he is not. Mm -hmm. in, in this he case, remember, in this moment, remember that the answer is from the rest of the people. ¿verdad? En este caso, Azucena, la pregunta Pero estamos viendo. Marlon wearing, ¿verdad? Y en este caso, Marlon, mm -hmm. la oportunidad de responder sería para los compañeros, ¿verdad? Porque vamos a utilizar como la Cindy. tercera persona, ¿verdad? Is she yes, wearing is. No, uh, is. white pink blouse? Ajá. Is Cindy wearing a pink blouse, people? Take a look at Cindy. Contesto uh, yo. All the rest, ajá. Uh -huh. The two people. Sí, creo yes. que cualquiera puede. Yes. Any person, yes. exactly. She is. Yes, a she is. A pink. A pink. Pink shirt. Blouse. Pink blouse. Thank you. Pink, pink blouse. Shirt. Perfect. That is how pink we blouse. do it. Así lo vamos a ir eh, haciendo alternado. Si preguntan acerca de mí, yo no respondo porque yo serví solo de modelo, ¿verdad? Para la práctica. Los demás compañeros sí pueden responder. Así como en el caso, Madeline hizo la pregunta acerca de Cindy, a Azucena y Napoleón, los dos responden a Azucena. la pregunta. Ajá. Is y así she vamos wearing a, a hat? ¿Sí? ¿Is Azucena mm -hmm. wearing a hat? No, no, she is not. No, she is not. Cindy, answer, please. Uh, is she... El nombre no me recuerdo. Madeline. Mm -hmm. Madeline. Is she wearing red? Is she yes. wearing? Yes. Dress. Yes. Dress. Dress. Mm -hmm. Ah, dress. Ah, uh, dress. Mm -hmm. No, I have me, la, me la estoy imaginando porque no la veo. No problem. Sí. No problem. Ajá. Ajá. Sí. No problem. Igual no, no, Voy a preguntar yo. Um. Is Azucena a wearing? Uh, sweater. What do you think, sí. Cindy? Yes, she no, is she... or no, she isn't. No, she's not. No, she isn't. No, she isn't. Thank you. Continue like that, people. Thank you so much. Ay, perfect, hasta perfect. ahorita puedo verlo. Okay. Excellent. Thank you. Okay. Um, yes, he is. Yes, he isn't. Bueno, ya creo sí. que no. Bueno, alguien más. <ríe> Vaya, compa, esme. Yo. Bueno, vamos con la mamá. Eh, is he wearing uh, pants? Is, is he wearing pants? Um, no. Is she? Is she? Is she? Tiene que ser. Ah, uh, yes. <laughs> okay. Next person. I am sure. Uh, is he wearing a belt? What is? Belt cincho. Oh. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes. Uh, um uh, no, no. No, he isn't. No, he isn't. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Other person? Yes, no problem. Carla. Mm -hmm. Carla. <laughs> Welcome, Carla. 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 
Carla, ¿está bien, Carla? Yes. Okay. Is she wearing glasses? Yes. 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 Other question, people? Thank you. Wearing a uh, jacket. No, it's no, she's no, she no, she is no, she... no, wearing is her phone. Is she wearing headphones? No, yes, she is. Yes, she is. Yes, she is. Okay. She is wearing blue t-shirt. Yes. No. She uh, blue. The shoe. Yes. Is the blue color is black. Is black. No, she is. Um, He's wearing a t-shirt color, navy. Navy. Yeah, is yes, dark, she is dark blue. Dark blue. Da ah. Dark blue. Oh, yes. Ya son los dark superhéroes. Blue. Son. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Thank you, people. Continue working. Perfect. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Okay. Ish. <laughs> Okay. He is wearing a skirt. Uh, a skirt? No, no, she is not. No, she is not. Is Ruth wearing a high heel? <laughs> no. <laughs> no, no, she is no, not. No, no, she is not. She is not. No. Mm -hmm. okay. um, is Anna wearing a red blouse? No, she isn't. No, she isn't. <laughs> okay. Right. Is teacher and is teacher wearing the shirt? A t-shirt? T-shirt? No. 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 Yes. No. Yes. It's a t-shirt. No. Yes. A t-shirt. No. A t-shirt no anda con camiseta. No. All right. Perfect. No. Exactly. This one, right? This is a t-shirt. Right? Um, this is a t-shirt. And the formal yes. is shirt. Shirt, yes. yes. Exactly. She's wearing a shirt. She. She. <laughs> okay, thank you so much. I was going to say, excuse me? No, 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 no. No, <laughs> no he, all right. Thank you, thank you. Good job. Just send the feedback before I leave on this group. Remember, when you talk about something plural, for example, mm -hmm. is she wearing high heels? High heels is plural. No ad necessary, right? Double yeah. check on that, right? But the rest was fine. Thank yes. you so much. Perfect, perfect. Thank, thank, you, thank, you, you. thank you, thank you. My bye. pleasure. Thank you, thank you. Continuamos. She is she uh, is Anna wearing. Um. Eh, profe, is eh, bueno, Lina eso wearing tiene... a... Ah. Uh -huh. Is Lina wearing a... Blue t-shirt? No. no, she isn't. No, she isn't. Eh, ¿Puede sustituir, profesor, en lugar de he, sí. is Rolando wearing? ¿Se puede hacer eso? It's ah, possible, okay. it's possible. In this case... It is possible because you are the only boy in the practice, right? It is very specific, right? Como solo es ustedes. Bueno, aparte que ahora que ya vine yo, ¿verdad? 
Entonces sería is he, va, porque is solo he. se refiere a mí. Solo like, se pero... refiere a usted y no, y, y, es, y no es como se llama, o sea, es bien específico porque sí, usted sí. era el único varón. En Correcto. este caso, si estamos nosotros Ellas, dos, varias... ah, ahí sí no, porque si usted le dice is she, ¿y a quién hace referencia? Okay, okay. A Rina, Entonces, Carolina, decir... the name is better. It's Rina wearing. Exactly, exactly. In this case, right. Right, porque ya llegué yo a la práctica, si fuera sí. posible, ya no podríamos decir is he, porque usted va a decir, ¿y, y quién, Rolando uh -huh. o Gonzalo? ¿Y a quién? Exactly. Right? Uh -huh. okay. In this case, better. Sí. Right? Thank, okay. you so much. Thank, Thank you. We're okay. going to return to the main room. Thank you so much for the time in the practice. I appreciate that. Thank you, thank you. Okay. Okay. Bueno, ya, chao. Chao. Thank you so much, everyone, for the practice. I checked on you, and you were doing really nice on that one, giving asking correct questions and giving correct answers. You are doing fine. Just remember on, on the same feedback before the practice. If you talk about something in plural, remember the article A is not necessary. Just remember that information, and we are fine. Nada más como eh, reforzando eh, el comentario y la retroalimentación previo a la práctica, recordar que cuando hablamos de un elemento en plural, ya sea shoes, jeans, shorts, headphones, ¿verdad? todos esos artículos que se consideran plurales, no utilizamos el artículo A. ¿verdad? Eso eh, se lo mencioné, igualmente se lo vuelvo a repetir para que lo tengamos ahí bien en mente, ¿verdad? cuando estamos expresando las ideas. But the rest, Nice job. Congratulations to all of you. At this moment, let me check on the attendance. And when you listen to your name, please make a verbal confirmation that you are part of the video conference. Let's start. Alejandra Gabriela Perez. Alejandra Gabriela Perez. At this moment. Ana Guadalupe Fuentes. Present teacher. Here. Azucena Enríquez de López. Present. Thank you. Brian Joalmo Rodas. Present. Thank you, thank you. Carolina Abigail Vázquez. Present. Thank you. Cindy Tatiana Vázquez. Present. Thank you. Cira Berfale Aguilar. Present. Thank you. Claudia Elizabeth Martínez. Claudia Elizabeth, not at this moment. Erika Vanessa Marroquín. Present. Thank you so much. Esmeralda Janet Méndez. Present teacher. Thank you so much. Evelyn Abigail Ramos. Present teacher. Thank you. Uh, let's see, Fátima del Carmen Amaya. Present. Thank you. Uh, Giselle Marie Hernandez. Miss Giselle. All right. I continue. Indira Nirvana Hernandez. Present teacher. Thank you. Thank you. Ana Ivania Guevara. Present. Thank you. Jose Hernan Maravilla. I guess he's not available. Josué Abraham López. Josué Abraham, probably not. Carla Guadalupe Pacheco. Carla Guadalupe Pacheco. All right, I continue. Carla Lizeth Méndez. Thank you. Luis Daniel Rosa. Present teacher. Thank you so much. Madeline Beatriz Morán. Present. 
Thank you. Maria Jose Sandoval, I guess she's not available. Mariana Dolores Moreno. Present teacher. Thank you. Marlon Napoleon Fuentes. Present. Thank you. Rina Estela Garcia. Present. Thank you so much. Rolando Guzman. Present teacher. Thank you so much. Ruth Stephanie Melendez. Present teacher. Thank you, thank you. Uh, Sandra Marisol Campos. Present teacher. Thank you. Tito Alberto Hernández. Present teacher. Thank you. And Xiomara Alejandra Lara. Marroquín Lara. Present teacher. Thank you so much. Perfect, perfect. All right, people, it was a pleasure for me to work with you today. And I wish you a good night and a perfect day tomorrow, right? Les deseo una feliz noche y que mañana su día sea muy bonito y espero verles por acá para la práctica del día jueves. No sin antes recordarles igual y animarles a seguir trabajando en la plataforma. Si puede mañana, Echémosle gana y seguimos avanzando en los contenidos. Y si es posible, este fin de semana completamos ya las cinco tareas y quedamos ya solventes con el progreso que debemos completar en la plataforma. Así que les animo, siempre echémosle ganas. Eso créanme, le va a ayudar mucho para seguir, eh, para alcanzar su objetivo, que es dominar un segundo idioma. All right. Thank you so much, everyone, and have a good night. Good night. Good night. Have a good night. Bye, Bye. people. Good night. Good night. Take care. Good night. See you tomorrow. Bye. Take care. Bye-bye, everyone. Bye. Thank you.